lived on Earth before the dinosaurs? It's no secret that during our planet's life, evolution has undergone rehauls and development almost from scratch. There have been mass extinctions of animals and plants several times over. Around 200 million years ago, the Earth was inhabited by giant lizards, the dinosaurs. Since the first fossils were discovered and the dinosaurs' appearance reconstructed, they grow more popular with each passing year. Dinosaurs are featured in short movies and cartoons and turn up as characters in children's programs, comic books, and even computer games. The reason for the dinosaurs' popularity begins with their appearance. Their size was unusual compared to animals in the modern world. From a human perspective, dinosaurs are perfect hunters and giant monsters. They were the masters of the plants then, just as humans are now. But even before the dinosaurs, the Earth was nonetheless inhabited by similarly interesting creatures. In this video, we'll tell you about all the beasts that lived long before the dinosaurs that were just as strange and unusual. Cynonathus The remains of this tiny, woolly predator has been found in Africa and South America. Although extremely similar to modern mammals, the Cynonathus is still just a distant relative. Scientists have classified the animal as a therapsid. These beast eaters lived on our planet not long before the age of dinosaurs, but also millions of years before the first mammals appeared. Their appearance somewhat resembled that of an ordinary wolf. By size, Cynonathus was rather comparable to the gregarious predator we know. Apparently, this is why scientists assume that the Cynonathus' lifestyle and hunting patterns were similar to the gray forest predators we recognize today. Helicoprion Though these marine predators look much like sharks in appearance, they are not their ancestors exactly. The Helicoprion are actually closer in relation to the modern perch. They seem to have appeared here 40 million years prior to the dinosaurs and 20 million years after that disappeared from the face of the earth. No creature to have lived since the Helicoprion has had a mouth mechanism even remotely similar to this animal's jaws. In fact, these fish's lower jaws resembled a circular saw and can rotate, practically sawing its prey apart with its sharp teeth. The Lato Archon Sarphagus The eldest member of the Ichthyosaurs line is direct evidence of the processes of evolution. It's believed that this 9-meter-long sea lizard became the menace of the world's oceans for 8 million years following the Permian extinction. This means that in order for the species to survive, the Thaladoarchon occupied a vacated niche of larger marine predators. The ichthyosaurs went extinct approximately 25 million years before dinosaurs went extinct. Perhaps they just couldn't compete with some of the new challengers to the throne of sea hunters. Dimetrodon Due to its huge dorsal crest, the Dimetrodon is often considered a dinosaur and placed in dinosaur-era kits. In fact, some specialists believe that the Dimetrodon was a relative of the Stegosaurus. Dimetrodons, however, were synapsids. This means they were closer to mammals than they were dinosaurs. And to be fair, they disappeared around 50 million years before the first true dinosaurs. Scientists believe that with a length of up to 4.5 meters, or 15 feet, the Dimetrodon was ranked as the largest predator of its time. Camaroceras The Paleozoic seas were inhabited by cephalopod mollusks and crustaceans, and the Camaroceraceans were most likely some of the most important creatures in the food chain of the ancient underwater world. Scientists have found shells from this clam that grew up to 10 meters, or 33 feet. One could picture what such a monster would have looked like when its shell was also accompanied by a bunch of tentacles. More than likely, it was sustained by similar crustaceans and smaller cephalopods. Dunkleosteus Long before the dinosaurs, the Dunkleosteus reigned as another monster of the sea. Weighing in at 4 tons and up to 10 meters, or 33 feet in length, this fish feared no being. The presence of thick armor and powerful jaws made it a major predator in the ancient seas and oceans, and this was 400 million years before the age of dinosaurs. There's speculation that the Dunkleosteus' main food source were primordial sharks, which it was able to literally bite in half. According to researchers, the power of its bite would be comparable to modern crocodiles. 
Estamenosuchus. By appearance alone, you couldn't tell that the Estamenosuchus was a formidable beast, and scientists are still on the fence concerning its predatory preferences. This monster eater looked like a cross between a hippopotamus and a triceratops, but with a weight of around 450 kilograms, or 992 pounds, and a length of over 4 meters, about 13 feet, it was definitely a sizable animal for its time. The Estamenosuchus had fairly sharp teeth, suggesting it was carnivorous. At the same time, however, these animals had a very developed digestive system, which was more typical of herbivores. It is even possible that they evolved into omnivores, like modern pigs. Anomalocaris They were also giants specific to the Cambrian period as well. Of course, they were still rather distant from later monsters, but at one time, the largest underwater predator was the Anomalocaris. It was an arthropod about 60 centimeters or 2 feet long, with a remarkable structure for its eyes in addition to its size. The creature was noted for its excellent vision. The dual-faceted eyes contained 16,000 hexagonal shapes. A modern fly, by comparison, has four times fewer of such lenses. Hallucigenia This 3 centimeter long worm, or 1.2 inches, was one of the strangest creatures to have ever lived on Earth. Imagine a worm with two rows of stilted legs and a spine throughout its back. Now add an elongated head with a pair of simple eyes. It's possible this weird appearance was the reason behind its name. Scientists speculate that Hallucigenia were the ancestors of modern arthropods. Arthropleura Having gone extinct 300 million years ago, these giant millipedes were over 2.5 meters long, or 8 feet, and considered to be the largest invertebrates ever created by nature. The flat millipede is thought to have had 30 pairs of legs and a tough, chitinous shell. Not a single fossil, however, was found to have a preserved mouth mechanism. Therefore, the way this ancient creature feasted and tasted its environment is still a mystery to scientists. Carnifex Although only two skeletons of this crocodilomorph have ever been discovered, it can attest to being the strangest of all known members of its genus. Carnifex inhabited the swamps of what is now North America approximately 230 million years ago. Presumably, modern alligators evolved from this beast. This 3-meter or 9-feet-long creature's main oddity was that it moved across land on two legs. That's correct, the Carnifex used only its hind legs to walk. Without a doubt, dinosaurs were the pinnacle of evolution during their era. But each of these unusual animals show us that across all times, nature has created beings that, much like dinosaurs, are capable of inspiring the imagination with their appearance, size, and abilities to adapt to their surrounding environment. In the struggle for a place under the sun, they sought to occupy various vacated niches in the food chain, and subsequently, they themselves gave way to future contenders for the title of ruler of the planet. Evolution never ceases its motion. Even now, nature is constantly working to improve all its species to better adapt to a changing worldscape. And if humankind is lucky enough to continue forward along this difficult path, then millions of years from now, our distant descendants will also admire the animals that lived in our time, just as we now admire the dinosaurs of eras gone by.